Hey everyone, today we're gonna to talk about eating artichokes, these guys. So what exactly is an artichoke? Well, it's basically a flower. If it was allowed to like fully bloom, it would turn into this like giant green leafed flower that has these like bursting purple pillars that kind of pop up from the middle. It's actually quite pretty. You can't eat artichokes in that state. You can only eat them when they're still kind of young and immature, like me. Okay, well maybe the latter part. But anyway, the artichoke is made up in a few different things. There's the stem of the artichoke. This is really important when you're buying artichokes. You want a long stem on it because this means that the heart isn't drying out. You also want to look for leaves that are really tight and taut and you want a nice even green color. Some spotting, browning, that's totally okay. Once you've purchased your artichokes, the best way to store them because they are a flower is to store them like cut flowers. So when you bring them home, just trim off the stem of the artichoke and just place it in a glass with some water and pop it in the fridge. That'll keep the artichoke moist and fresh and tasty. The thing is though, artichokes don't last that long. Once you bring them home, you want to enjoy them within a few days, two to three days at most. They start to kind of get bitter after that. So how do you eat an artichoke? Well, there's a couple different ways you can cook an artichoke. You can boil it, you can steam it, you can braise it, you can bake it. But after you've prepped the artichoke, that's the main, the first thing that you wanna start with. So to prep the artichoke, cut off the stem so the artichoke will actually sit flat. Then you wanna trim off about a half inch from the top of the artichoke. If it happens to be one of those really armor covered artichokes where the leaves have thorns on the top, take your culinary scissors and trim off any of the thorns on the artichoke. Cook it how you prefer, whether it's boiling or steaming or whatever. But once the artichoke is cooked, if it's cooked perfectly, it should be really easy to eat. The leaves will actually just fall off as you pull them off the artichoke. And there's a little bit of meat on the leaves, on the outer leaves, that you can scrape off with your teeth. As you get closer to the center of the artichoke, the leaves become more tender and you can actually eat even the whole leaf itself. When you get to the center of it, you'll find the choke, which is kind of furry and fuzzy. Don't eat that, you actually can choke on it. But below that is the heart. So you can scrape away the choke and then eat the heart of the artichoke, which is one of the best parts. So that's how you eat an artichoke. If you like this video, hey, give me a thumbs up. If there's something you wanna see, drop a comment down below. And if you like to cook like I do, I release new videos every single week. So please subscribe.